In her return to Billie Jean King Cup action, Emma Raducanu is back in the winner's circle, in the toughest match, she could have got from the schedule, as she faced former WTA Finals champion, and former top five player in Caroline Garcia, to keep Great Britain on track. Raducanu hadn't played Billie Jean King Cup, since 2022, but needed to play one more time, in the cycle to keep her Olympic Games hopes alive. Despite having other players, ahead of her in the rankings such as, Harriet Dart and Heather Watson, this of course is very much a misleading stat, as Radu Kanu has just returned from injury. This meant that the former US Open champion, was always going to play in France, alongside fellow top Brit, Katie Bolter. It was quite the comeback too, both in terms of the overall tie, and also the match for Radu Kanu, as she lost the first set 6-3 to Garcia, in her first match since Indian Wells, where she lost to Irina Sabalenka. It was very much chances, a plenty given to Garcia early on at 2-1 down, but Radu Kanu stayed firm, only to lose her serve back-to-back, -back, despite breaking back at 4-3. Garcia eased to an easy hold at 6-3 to claim the set. Radu Kanu looked in trouble, as she lost the opening game of the second set, and her serve. She didn't get it back until 2-2 but then broke again, at 4-2 to begin the comeback. Despite being two break points, down eventually, she claimed the set and was hoisted back into the match. It was nearly over quicker, than expected well for Radu Kanu anyway. This is pivotal for Great Britain with Diane Parry, thrashing Katie Bolter earlier today in a shock upset 6-2, 6-0. Tomorrow, it will revert with Radu Kanu playing Parry, and Bolter playing Garcia in the best-of-five format.